I got your message. What do you need? <laughs> Two tickets to the opening of the Adam Bar tonight. Don't do that part. <laughs> Hello, boys. Got a little surprise for you. Hide the crucifix. Uh, Beelzebuz is here. <laughs> oh, honey. I got a fake laugh with your name all over it. <laughs> now I want you to meet my mother-in-law, Sylvia Walker. Haul it in here, Syl. <laughs> Nice to meet you. <laughs> May I sit down? Uh, be my guest. Hey, that's the dragon lady? Oh. That little pocket person is, is... is the one who strikes fear in your, in your heart facsimile? Well, it might have been exaggerating a little bit, but, uh, you know, I thought about it, and you're right. Getting along with people like Madison Avenue is a two-way street. Madison Avenue is a one-way street. Oh, well, that explains why those two cops had driving a chokehold last night. <laughs> but you know what? The goiter and I had a long talk, and, uh... <laughs> she's not such a bad old bird after all. Right, Sue? What's that, dear? <laughs> oh, she's thinking about her friends in the lollipop guild. <laughs> in the war between the states. <laughs> oh, well, Ma, be a love and get a little snicky snack for sale, okay? Just a little bird seed and some sugar water. You can put it anywhere, she'll find it. I, I just don't get it. I can't believe someone as big as Stan came out of that tiny little woman. Well, I'm no expert, but I read an article once in Sky Miles magazine. Apparently, when they come out, they're much smaller. <laughs> Ugh, the whole thing's a horror. It's nice to see Karen, you know, putting a little effort. You know, I knew if she just reached out to her... She... Karen? She took off. Well, what are we gonna do? We have to be at the club in less than an hour. And I still need time to soak and spritz before I can sizzle. <laughs> Jack, relax. She's coming back. I mean, Karen might be evil, but she's not going to stick us with her mother-in-law for the rest of the night. Can I get a kamikaze? Rum and coke, please. Hot tea, please. 